What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Shino coming at you with another banger, man. So, look, as you saw from the title and the thumbnail, bro, you already know what time it is. In this video, bro, I'm going to be showing y'all the best new demigod build on NBA 2K21 next gen. Trust me, bro, this build could literally do it all. He could shoot, he could drive, he could play defense, he could play make, he could literally do every single thing in the game. Trust me, bro, this build will not disappoint you. So, without further ado, man, let's get straight into it. So, for the position, bro, you want to put it to power forward, bro. Trust me, do not make a point guard or shooting guard build. You can literally get way better stats and badges with the power four. Trust me, make a power four. The hand, you know, so you can just pick any hand you want and your jersey number, all that. So look, for the height, bro, you basically just want to put him to 6'7", and for the weight, you want to put him to 211 pounds. You know what I'm saying? Basically lowest weight. And then for the wingspan, you want to put a 6'11 wingspan, and then the body shape is, you know what I'm saying, is anything that you want. But me personally, bro, you have to pick slight, you know what I'm saying, if you want to drip up. So look, I'm just fast forward through all these attributes, you know what I'm saying, because I know you don't want to see that, you know what I'm saying, so I'll be right back. You can see, bro, I get a 93 driving layup, a 94 driving dunk, a 95 mid range, a 93 pointer. Um, and also because of the plus four, you know what I'm saying, I will be at a 94 three pointer and I will be at a 99 mid range, 84 ball handle, and also with the plus four, it will be to an 88, you know what I'm saying? So a 95 perimeter defense, an 84 block, an 82 rebound, an 85 speed, an 81 acceleration. A 71 vertical, so trust me, I will get up there, and also a 95 stamina. But look, you know, saying plus your dream rap, bro. I will have a 99 stamina, bro. It's crazy. Basically, a 90 speed and 85 acceleration. So for the takeover, bro, I usually run spot up precision and uh, ankle breaking shots. You know, so because I gotta take my ankles. Or you could run spot up precision. You know, so just shoot from deep, lights out, and run finishing moves you know saying crazy contact dunks bro just do it all but for me you know saying this is my play style so spot of precision and uh ankle breaking shots look as you can see bro i made a scoring machine this build is nothing like julius Randle. i ain't gonna cap you could literally walk around the whole park every single person has this build this build is the best build on nba 2 to the one next gen here is my bad setup you know saying i usually run fearless finisher on gold uh posterizer hall of fame you know say because i get a lot of contact dunks and i run slithery finisher on gold bro trust me slithery finisher you need this badge you need this badge i'm telling you this badge is literally op these two badges slithery finisher and posterizer bro bro it's over you could run heat seeker on gold you know so but i don't really have it because i don't have slasher take so i just leave it on giant slayer then for the shooting badges i use catch and shoot gold uh blinders hall of fame bro blinders bro trust me this badge is really needed also deep threes is basically limitless range dead eye you don't really have to run that at because you have blinders but i just leave it on silver and then the hot shot bro you could literally get takeover in two shots bro and two shots with hot shot and then hazel hunter but you have to have that hall of fame clutch shooter i run that on silver uh green machine i run that on gold and uh, yeah those are my shooting badges then for the playmaking badges you know what i'm saying but you got to get hall of fame quick first step obviously you know what i'm saying tight handles i'll put that on gold and then dimer i usually run dimer on gold you know what i'm saying because my teammate unpluckable you need that on silver gold an anchor breaker i run that on silver and also have handles for days and uh space create on gold these are my playmaking badges then for my defensive badges i have clamps on hall of fame you know saying bro trust me bro clamps on hall of fame bro you are a lockdown trust me intimidator i run that on gold the rim protector i run that on silver you know because sometimes i have to guard the bigs so i have rim protector on silver for rebound chaser i have that on silver as well and also have heart crusher bro trust me heart crusher bro like this badge is really 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 useful you know? then i also have tireless defender silver chase down artist on silver so here is my defensive badges so look that is it for the video you know what i'm saying if you're new to the channel make sure to hit that like button hit that sub button you know what i'm saying comment something you know what I'm saying do all that good stuff like i really do appreciate all the love and support and uh, without further ado i'll see y'all boys in the next video